<laughs> All right. So, um, this is DS Madness. So we're gonna have got a bunch of games. So we we don't expect me to play each of these games nearly as long as we played Pac Man. <laughs> Welcome to Sunday. Like, you know, don't expect me to play any of these games uh, as nearly as long as we play Pac-Man. This is going to be like the fast food of, of live streaming. Uh, we're just going to bust through these pack of games because we got a decent amount to get through. So let's just boot this stuff up, shall we? Um, let's see here. What do we got? First game is Crash Boom Bang. Crash Boom Bang. Let's see what this funny stuff's all about, shall we? I'm sure it's going to be just grand. All right. Oh, fuck! That is so crusty with all the fucking audio! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! That was so loud! <laughs> what the fuck, dude? I didn't know there was a Crash Bandicoot game on the Nintendo DS! <laughs> This is, dude. This is the DS madness I remember. This is the, D this is the DS madness I forgot about. Crash boom bang. Oh man, I'm excited for this one. Oh, hold up. Well, I guess I'm. I might as well not even use the, the dual shot controller. I didn't know Crash Bandicoot was on the DS, dude. All right, let's start. How do I start? I don't know these controls. Shit. <laughs> right. Oh okay, here we go. Start a new game from the beginning with a new character. Wouldn't have it any other way. Why is X the confirmation button? Oh my gosh. <laughs> character select. Hold up. I, I always forget with the DS. I, I have these. Uh, I have the. I can switch the screen so you guys can always see both screens. Give me one second. We'll, we'll keep it like this for a bit. Who the hell is Pinstripe? Hold on, hold up. Pura? Pura from Breath of the Wild? Crash, bit of a bumbling hero. Compared to Pac-Man? <laughs> Compared to Pac-Man, I'm sure he's an absolute genius. Crash is always saving the world. Pura. Pura is an eccentric tiger, tiger cub and good friend of Coco's. Pinstripe is a cool looking guy, but also extremely dangerous. You guys can't see the, the descriptions because they're all on this screen. And then we got Shadow Man, Shadow Man, Shadow Man, Shadow Woman, and Coco. Crash's younger sister and one smart girl. Well, let's just play as Crash. I don't know. I'm not really a big Crash Bandicoot fan, so... We'll just keep the name. Festival Mode, My Room Adventure Mode. Oh, let's just do Adventure. I want to see the story and lore of this. Follow this map every step of the way. This is some. This audio has got some crust to it, though. I know this. I know of just the people for this job. Those bright, energetic, naive bunch of characters who don't suspect a thing. I'll calm them into working for me, and the super big power crystal will be mine. Wah ha 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 ha. The World Cannonball Race. The prize is 100,000 or 100 million dollars. Looks like my lucky break. Why is he, why is a grown man still living with his sister? I don't know, I'm not like judging. But like, it's not like they live, it's like not all the family. It's like, why is it a grown adult man still live with just his sister? Not their mom, not their dad, no other sibling. That's the part that confuses me a little bit. Is this thing on? Ladies and I just want to see the gameplay. I don't care about this story. I quite frankly don't give a shit. I want to see what the gameplay is like. I thought you couldn't go worse than the Pac-Man game. Here on Sunday streams, we try to go to a void darker than ever known before. I urge you, come on. Just, I want to see how this game plays. Is, does this play like a traditional Crash game? I'm expecting you all to combine your brains and brawn to meet the uh, glorious prize money. Hurry up and get to the finish line. All right, this is the moment of truth, chat. This is what we've been waiting for. Here we go. Moment of truth. How's this game going to play? 
That makes sense, Doc P. His sister watches over him in his struggling crack addiction. That, that makes sense. Well, what a good sister he has. Yeah, he's crazy. He's got like a crazy murderer smile. He's like, you know how many women's feet I've cut off in the past month? <laughs> Not enough. Used items to help you win because you're not good enough on your own accord. Okay, good. Fine. I'm ready. I don't know. Okay. Touch the item icon. This game is struggling. No matter how much you pedal, you'll barely make it. Why would I want that? How do I start the damn game? What is happening? How do I start playing the game? What is this? What do you mean pinstripe use a crazy compass? Is this like a, a turn-based RPG? Playing. This is not Crash Bandicoot. This is shitty Mario Party. <laughs> this is fucking abysmal. <laughs> oh, what the hell. You got hungry and ate it up. Minus 500 points. Time for minigame. Oh, great. Can't wait to see how this plays. Find and touch the mistakes. What the fuck is wrong with Crash? What the hell's wrong with his teeth, bro? What I even click on that's different? Is this a matching game? The phone's different. Robot's different. That's not different. I don't know. Books, I guess, on the table? This really is horrible Mario Party. Holy shit. Oh, the, the picture. Did I win? I won. Okay. Didn't we play that Sesame Street game that Grover Elmo won where we had to do the matching and I couldn't figure out what the hell was different about any of the images? There was something really creepy. Oh yeah, it, it, we were playing that Elmo one and we had to like brush the horse's teeth and it was like so cursed. Pura is currently ahead. I want to play one more mini game. I want to see what this next mini game is. I got to turn on my heater because it's cold as shit. Hey, you guys can have fun rolling the dice and whatever the hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. There is so much. There's way more dialogue in this than there is Mario Party. And there's like no multiplayer in this. Yeah, use this. Perfect. Sure. Crash use magnifying glass. I gotta turn it right here. It's like ice cold today. Let me know if it's too loud. I, the heater's pretty silent, but if it's too loud, let me know. I can turn it off so it doesn't distract from the stream. Not that you guys are going to be like so... You're you're going to be crying yourselves to sleep that you can't see this game in its entirety. I'm with whoever said that this game was worse than Pac-Man 2. Well, this is just the beginning. Who knows what other freaking games we got lined up tonight. This is so bad. This is so, like, depressingly bad. What the fuck? Oh shit, I'm in prison! I'm getting shipped off! What it... What is going on? I just got shipped off to, like, another island! I went to Brazil! It's like, yeah, it's the Brazil meme. Yes, I'm ready for a minigame. Crash shooting. Nice, dude. You are surrounded by enemies. Shoot down the other planes. Holy cow, dude. Hold up. Uh, 
Stop, 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 stop. I'm trying to show the playing screen. There we go. I'm trying to show you guys what I'm supposed to do, dude. This controls horribly. You think control is with like a fake touch screen? How do I fire? What's the button to shoot? Or am I supposed to just collect apples? <laughs> the airplane sound like someone went into the mic. I don't know what's the fire button. I'm gonna fucking crash. What buttons? I haven't seen. You guys want to see what the? You want to translate what the buttons are on my keyboard, buddy? You want to tell me what the hell all these keyboard buttons possibly do plus touchscreen controls? This game blows. Am I winning? Backing up garbage truck. Beep, 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 beep. Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck? That's <laughs> not what I even wanted to click on. Uh. <laughs> what in fuck's name are you doing? <laughs> You're on top to let the others catch up. Uh, that's, that's, that's about all I can handle from Crash Bandicoot. I can't do anymore. I'm sorry, I can't. I can't do anymore. Moving on. That was, that was Crash something. Crash Boom Bang. Made me want to boom bang my head into a metal shelf. Uh, next up is Fairyland. Melody of Magic. Fairyland. This is what you guys come to see, right? Oh god, it's a fucking Ubisoft game, I just saw. It's a Ubisoft game, why? Why? No, 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 no. Hi. What the fuck is this? <laughs> to perform all the special spells. The magic wand is like your Nintendo DS stylus. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Here we go! <gasps> Holy fuck! What happened? <laughs> I don't even know what she said! <laughs> I don't even know what she said! What did she even say? Was that English? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Why is the audio so shit? Because it's a compressed DS speaker, not even the 3DS that had better audio. It's a compressed SDS speaker being blown up into my, my computer. <laughs> <laughs> Fairy Land? <laughs> Why is there's there's like there's like four times the viewers watching this than Silent Hills? One of the most legendary horror guy games by Hideo Kojima. And you guys are like no no Fairyland. Fuck me, man. Hold up, is there an audio? <laughs> I gotta see if there's an audio uh thing I can change. <laughs> Holy cow. I can't even think about what I want to say. Uh, audio driver or something? Not driver, whatever. Plug-in, there we go. Is there like a, I want to see if there's a different audio plug-in. Holy shit, man. Sound settings, here we go. Okay. Let's see if this sounds any better. I... Am I crazy? Is this placebo effect or does the audio sound better now? I changed plugins. It sounds better, right? Yeah, okay. Not that you guys care. I'm sure that this is not like... Make it or break it... You know, storytelling. But let's pick our dress. Before we begin, 
You must put on your princess dress, shoes, and tiara. Touch the tiara with your wand. Okay. Gotta put on our princess dress, Chet. Okay, let's put on our pretty princess dress. Looks like exactly like Princess Peach's dress. Excellent, you did it. If you're ready to go back to your room, <laughs> go home. Go home and lock the door. The annual purge will now commence. Fairyland of the way past. Touch the magic mirror and let's continue our journey. What like genre of, what genre of game is this? Is this a strand holy shit? Lake. Is this a strand game? Let's play at the melody lake. Let's do it. I'm on board. Uh, Welcome to Fairyland and Princess. Come and meet my two fairy sisters. Hello, Princess. I'm Hello, Poppet! How are you? You like my big Funko Pop head? Oh, yeah. Or <laughs> I'm so smart, my head's 500 times the size of me body. I'm the fairy of song, and I make sure that song is everywhere. As for me, my duty is to spread music all over fairyland. Oh, man. Again, I haven't made this joke in a while, so I... It's been like a, it's been a few months, so I can reuse this joke. But this reminds me of when people at my job and in real life find out that I stream on Twitch. And they always ask me, they find out that I'm a live streamer, and they're like, Oh, well, what do you stream, or what, what type of games do you play? They're like, Oh, do you, do you play Overwatch? Do you play Minecraft? And I'm like, I can't, it's hard to explain. <laughs> so I, I was like, I don't want to talk about it. I want to know what you do. Like, what the gameplay is. You've just been like hitting menus and shit. If you touch shit. the lily flowers with your magic wand, you can make them open up. Absolutely fabulous. Almost. What happened to my damn screen? Almost. If you touch the lily flowers with your magic wand, you can make them open up. The graphics are a 2 out of 10? What do you mean, Myth? This is the best the graphics I've ever seen. You did perfect. I feel like this is one of those games that like kids play and like the, the, the parents buy it for their kids and they're like, this is just a cute little fairy game. My son or daughter is going to love this. And then the kid's playing it. And then like whenever the, the mom or dad or grandma or grandpa leave the room, the fairy turns toward the kid and she's like, Kill your parents, kill your parents, kill your parents. And the mom and dad walk back in and say, like, well, 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 Welcome to, to, to fa fa Fairy Land. Your magic <laughs> that's that's kind of what I'm waiting for. Let's enter the wardrobe and see how well you did. Now let's look at the wardrobe and see how good of a job we did with our whatever the hell we did. I don't know what we did. With What, what did we do? This sounds like Booba. Now we got Rosalina's dress. As she turns the camera, like, are you alone? M -m -m Mommy and d -d Daddy keep the k kitchen knives in the second drawer. But if you stack up a bunch of books, you you could probably reach it. <laughs> yeah, touch, touch yourself in front of the DS camera. No, nobody's watching. Just a f -f fairy. I can't hear you? What? Oh no. The magic mirror is shaking. I think it's telling us something. My dear, it is Dude, the new season of Little Witch Academia is nuts. It's so good. You must help me break the evil spell over Fairyland. Fairyland awaits us. When do we play the game? I don't understand, man. Is this it? Is it a visual novel? Visit the Melody Apple Tree. Visit the Melody Apple Tree. This is the game. No, Pop, you lying sack of shit. What's this? Magic oh, tree no. shit. The witch has cursed our Melody Apple Tree. 
Look at how beautiful it used to be. Yeah, what a real shame. The it used to just be absolutely gorgeous. All the notes inside the roots of the melody apple tree. Is that Zelda? That's so offensive to Zelda. That is so offensive to Zelda. Then the tree will get its melody apples back. Almost. And almost. That's not it. That's not it. I'll pop the bubbles from the tree. I'm popping the bubbles. Inside. Then the tree will get its melody apples back. Wow, what riveting gameplay. A bubble shows up on the bottom screen here. I click it. And then an apple shows up on the tree over there. Dang, guys. Wow. Can you imagine this was, I guarantee you this game was $40. You can get both of No More Heroes 1 and 2 remastered for cheaper than it probably cost to buy just this game. Think about that one. Three more apples, guys. We need to stop Little Witch Academia from ever destroying the earth. Video games were a mistake. There's a lot of video good video games out there, but I would rather never be able to play a good video game if it meant that games like this didn't have to exist. Jibbity day. What does that mean? I'm gonna be hearing that in my sleep. I'm gonna be like, it's gonna be like a Russian sleep experiment. Princess, you brought the melody. Princess Zelda. That actually does kind of look like Zelda from Smash. Hold up. Wait a second. Maybe I'm just crazy. Isn't that Zelda's pose in, like, Smash 4 or something? Smash Wii U Zelda. Isn't that what her icon looks like? Maybe I'm just on meth. Maybe it's Brawl? Okay, yeah, definitely, definitely just doing a placebo effect in my head here. But I, I can still see it. I don't know why this image is so big. What the heck? Where is it? This is like going to be like the largest file size of Zelda I've ever seen in my life. But whatever. Here we go. I can see it. I can see it. You know? It, it, it's a bit of a stretch. But I, there's been, you know, more stretches in, in my lifetime. What's this game called? Fairyland Magicalicious or whatever? I don't know. I forgot what the name of this game was. Here's the, the, the golden apple from the tree. Home at last, princess. Oh my, look how the golden melody apple is decorating. Alright, let's see this new dress. Better be the hottest thing I've ever seen in my life. And then we're moving on. What does Jibbity Day mean, dude? That's so scary. What does that mean? What is she saying? Is, that, is it gibberish? It's a curse? Oh my gosh, dude. We're getting cursed on stream? Nope, Fairyland is done. Nope, 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 nope. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> that was Fairyland. Uh, the next game is going to have to do a lot to top that. That was pretty bad. So, we're going to we're going to we're going to switch gears a little bit. We're going to switch some gears, chat. Uh, going from Fairyland from Magic and Fairies to Science with this next game is called Science Papa. I don't know what this means. But this next game is called Science Papa. I'm very nervous. Also, don't forget that Fairyland was made by Ubisoft. Don't forget that either. Science Papa's up next. Wait, this one's by Activision? Oh, God. Wait, I gotta put the other screen up. There's, like, nothing on... Who's this? What? Is this anime? No, I skipped it. Okay, hold on. We gotta. We, no, no, no. We gotta. We gotta reload that. We gotta reset that. I did not mean to skip that masterpiece. 
We have to see this. This was licensed by Nintendo. Why? All right, hold up. No, we have to see whatever that cutscene was. I refuse to skip that. M Mad Monkey Studio. You had a lot of DS and 3DS games. I maybe we'll get to one that you had. I do not know. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Nice. So we got Futuristic Albert Einstein. We've got Grown Up Saria from Ocarina of Time. Uh, I don't know who that is. Don't know who that is. Wait, no, that's Rick from Rick and Morty! With a mustache! This is some scummy science papa. All right, let's see what this game is all about. New game. Is that the guy from Mega Man, Dr. Willy or whatever? <laughs> Come on in, Morty. We're, we're gonna go on some fantastic adventures, Morty. I've heard a lot about you. You're a science whiz, perfect, just what I need. And the lab assistant. You're a candidate for the Helix Prize for Science. What an honor. Where's that flyer? Oh, that's a plasma cutter. Here it is. Helix Prize for Science. If there's ever a global competition for science, I'd be happy to guide. You along and evaluate your work. Let's get started. Any of these experiments could turn out to be the scientific discovery of the century. Remember, never try to reproduce anything in this game without professional supervision. Oh boy. Well, luckily for you, Twitch chat, I am a certified professional. So, yeah, let's do some experiments. Let's make some, let's make some mustard gas. What the fuck is this? From Science Papa. Oh dear, we're going out of blanching agent. If we're going to start on any grand experiments, we're going to need a clean lab. Could you make some for the crew? You can mix that up, right? The blanching agent will whiten and disinfect just what we need. This is gonna teach us how to make our own, like, Windex? Is that all that this is? Make the solution by mixing sodium chloride or salt with water. Touch the tool icon. All right, all right. Go, 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 go. Yes, yes, yes. All right, now let's make some chemicals, chat. Science, let's go. Uh, what do we got here? We got, uh, some crack cocaine. We're making some, some, some fucking crack. How do I put crack in the dish? Boom. A little bit of liquid crack. Yeah, yeah, use the stylus as a spoon to draw in circles. Alright, let's mix this shit up. I'm on board. Hold up. Mix her up, son. How do I mix it up? What? I have to put in this shit too? What is this? Did I do it right? This doesn't look like any soap I've ever seen. Oh! So it is supposed to be like Cooking Mama, but like science pop. Is this made by the same people though? Is Cooking Mama made by Activision? Also, our shit exploded. What happened? Yeah, well, apparently it wasn't that bad. He said, good job. Well done. Oh, well, you guys can't see that because it didn't have the bottom screen shown. He was like, you did a great job, dude. What is a blanching agent? Just cleaning solution? Is that what we made? I don't know what we made. I've never heard of this game either. What am I supposed to do? What was I supposed to do? I didn't know what the fuck the controls were. Well, he doesn't care. He keeps saying that I'm, I'm phenomenal. He's like, yeah, great. You did perfect. I never played Cooking Mama, so I don't know what that game's even like.
It's just like this, but with food. I'd rather have Cooking Mama. I'd rather, like, do food and recipes and, guys, let's make Windex. Did you ever want it? Did you ever wish you had Mr. Clean, but you couldn't afford it? Well, here we go, kids. At least in Cooking Mama, you can kind of, like, replicate it. But this game is dangerous to replicate. Where are you going to get, like, you know, sulfuric acid from? I, I think I've already had enough of this game. That was science, Papa. That was horrible. That was horrible. Uh, next up, Wedding Dash. Wedding Dash. See, this is all about... Oh, fuck off. If you guys saw what I saw, you'd be pissed. Next up is Wedding Dash. I don't know what the hell this is going to be. Is that a dog with, like, smoke? Oh, I thought it was, like, smoke coming out of his mouth, but he has as one of the banners. Is there any audio for this game, or what? Empty Clip Studios. Wow. Imagine having your studio be called Empty Clip Studios, and you make a game called Wedding Dash. Career mode or endless reception? What? I cannot read this text. It's like the smallest text on the planet Earth. Only two days to go, Quinn. Oh shit, I actually hit the thing. I'll just read it. You guys have to pretend to know what's going on. Ring, ring. Oh, that's the wedding planner. Pink is so not me. It's over. Everything is ruined. Come on, it can't be that bad. The florist quit. The caterer has food poisoning and the reception hall is flooded. And I just fired my wedding planner. If all of that was really going on, just postpone your wedding. Just just postpone your damn celebration. Don't worry, you will figure something out. That's it, Quinn. You, you will be my wedding planner. How did I get myself into this? Wait a second. Hold up. Isn't that girl right there from a, another video game? Isn't that girl on the right from a phone game? Where you have to like serve customers? I feel like I remember my stepmom being obsessed with that. Or am I going crazy? Is that girl on the right with the apron on from a different video game? That looks so familiar. Maybe I'm just going, maybe my brain cells are just finally frying. It's Zelda, all right, well, there we go, Never mind. Hey, Quinn, ready for yoga? I am so stressed out, Flea. Is that her name? F-L-E? Flo. Sorry, Flo. I need to plan a wedding by Saturday. You're getting married? I wish. I don't even have anything to wear. Did you get a caterer yet? I have some names in here somewhere. I will never be able to pull this off. Calm down. All you need to do is make a bunch of calls. I am pretty good at talking on the phone. That's the spirit piece of cake. Cake? That's right. I need to, for, to confirm the cake order. You can do it. Holy shit, man. Now what? What do I do now? I did career mode. That What, what else is left? is going on goal six hundred dollars i have zero dollars i've just received important information from the bride and groom that will help me with their wedding planning be sure to read the information on their invitation before moving on wedding couple amy and mark nothing fancy for appetizer and dinner keep it simple and low budget fill the backyard with something lilies i can't read the text is like so small I don't fucking know, dude. This is so stupid. 
Let's get filet mignon. Nice and simple, right? Nice and cheap, just like how they like it. Uh, let's get um, crackers and cheese. And let's get them a rose bouquet. Perfect. Not bad, you got some of it right, but pay closer attention to the request next time. How the hell does this game have multiplayer? I can't read this. It just says, ready for the big day. Boom, 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 boom. This is wedding planners. The bride's Uncle Al's here. He's gonna sit at the heart table, drag him to the empty seat. What? Is this Uncle Al? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my gosh, this looks like shit. Wait, is it? Is that the name of the game? Wait, is Diner Dash what it was? Hold up, I gotta pull up a picture of Diner Dash. Is, does this game take place in the Diner Dash universe? Diner Dash. I was so right, you guys are all stupid. I was actually intelligent as shit. I was so smart and you guys were all stupid. Look at this. It's all connected like the, the, the Marvel movies. The audio is a little crusty. Don't don't worry about that. Look at this is the game I was talking about, and that's the same girl. That's the girl's friend, and her name was her name was I don't remember Abigail or something. See, and they were doing yoga together. So this is real. It takes place in the same universe. So I'm glad somebody in the chat knew what I was talking about. I thought I was having a fever dream. Yeah, this game takes place in the Diner Dash Cinematic Universe, but this one's called Wedding Planners or something. Is this what this game is called, Wedding Dash? Yeah, this is kind of rough. I mean, look at this. Like, are you guys seeing what we're looking at and you're telling me this is like peak video games? I can't tell, like, what's a human and what's like a JPEG. Please tell me I don't have to dance with your uncle, Ernig. What? I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. Get some spaghetti? I've never played Diner Dash, but like my stepmom was obsessed with it like years and years ago. So I remember seeing that character before. If I would have played this game as a kid, I would never have wanted to ever get married. If I would think that getting married was this, I would never, I would stay so far away from it. This looks like a Family Guy, like, 144p episode. This wedding is just like a fairy tale. The text is getting cut off. Bride's cousin just walked in. She can't wait to see Uncle Al. I I think we get the gist. I think we get the gist of it. I, I think we understand where that's going. Next. Next. Next one is called Windy X Windham. Windham. Windy Windham. I think I'm saying that right. Windy Windham. I don't know. We're going to figure it out. What the fuck am I looking at? Ninja Studios Presents. Wow, the game's already saving. Windy Windham. Is this a weeb game? That looks like one of the most anime weeb game logos I've ever seen. Windy Windham. Windamir. That was a start button. Oh my shit. It's a fighting game. Oh, it's Hatsune Miku versus, uh, what's the girl from Fooly Cooly? Haruko Haruhara? It's Haruko versus Hatsune Miku. Oh, jeez. Battle mode. Is there a story mode? Of course not. What the 
fuck, are you guys seeing this? <laughs> Kibiku! I love you, Kibiku-chan! You are so kawaii! Oh my fuck, that's just, that's just Demise from Skyward Sword. His name's just big! His name is big! <laughs> what the fuck? Kibiku and big! Dude, <laughs> what the fuck? You can tell this was this was given no translation time. Japanese people did not know what to call him, so I bet in J Japan they're like translate the Japanese word for big in English. It's just big. Hold up, I gotta put. I gotta. I gotta. Here's the song. Shut up. Shut up. What was this? I thought that this was Sins of the Father. Here we go. Where, 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 where. <laughs> I gotta turn off my heater. Fuck, this is this is actually kind of a banger. Dude. I'll be right back. What in fuck's name are you doing? Chungus. Uh, this is so stupid. How do I get Sans off the screen? Sorry, moving on. Saiyans. Saiyans dead? Hold up. How do I get the... Oh, there we go. Back to the awesome audio. Right, let's read their vitals here. Let's go back here. We got Kibuku. His height is 179 centimeters. I don't know any of this European bullshit. I don't know what the hell kilograms are. I don't know if any of these guys are heavy or what. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. Ashley. That font looks like complete garbage. We got Ashley. Beta? Beta? What? Be Beth. It says Beth. I can't read this, guys. The font sucks. How is, how is I supposed to... I can't tell it's Beth. Be yeah, sorry. Okay. Anyways. Jack. There we go. That's what I need. Jack. Sting? Well, I don't know what that is. <laughs> and then just G. We got a fucking demon. <laughs> got a sleep <laughs> Okay, so we got anime boy, big chungus, anim obligatory sexy anime girl, obligatory tomboy anime girl, obligatory guy that looks like Gendo from Evangelion, um, Wally character and the fucking egg-shaped demon. He looks like the mask from Super Mario Bros. 2. <laughs> I like your cut, G. He slaps from the back of the head. I like your cut, G. <laughs> Dude, let's play him. He's fucking insane. Yo, G. Dude, if he says I like your cut, I'm killing myself. <laughs> How do I progress the dialogue? There we go. Gah! Oh boy. It's fine to get all excited, but you don't like me looking at you? Die! Well, there's nothing for it. Jumped out of the frying pan into the fire. Wow. Holy shit. Round one! Round one! Oh, fuck you. <sighs> what the f what the fuck am I playing? I don't know how to attack. <laughs> this legit. Oh guys, dude, next Sunday we have to do flash game segment. We have to do uh, what what should be the name of the segment? I'll make a new logo and everything. We can't do horrible flash because we have horrible horror. What's a bad f word? Don't say fuckable flash. That's not what I'm saying. We need something flash. Never mind. I thought of a segment. I'm already dirty better than you guys. 
I'm going to do a Sunday stream segment next week. It's going to be called Farewell Flash. Because uh, in December, next month, next month, they're getting rid of support for Flash. So this is the last month that Flash Player will be available. So I'm going to do a Sunday stream segment called Farewell Flash. And it's going to be all of the worst Flash games that we can find before they, we say goodbye forever. So that will be next Sunday. We'll, we'll do Farewell Flash and make a logo and everything. So get ready, get ready for a bunch of games that look exactly like this bullshit. Get ready for a bunch of games that look exactly like this. Or like stick figure, like stick figure torture, suicide, double homicide. All those like horrible games where like stick figures are tied to chairs. They get like their genitals cut off and all kinds of like sick, disgusting serial killer shit that people were playing back in the day. I actually got a hit on the guy. Oh, hey, if you guys can find any bad Flash games, send them to me in at themilkyfinishers at gmail.com or at me either DM or media share of Discord. So either email them to me or send them to the Discord and I'll put them in the pack for next week. Well, okay, don't like send me the porn ones. I'm not, I'm not going to play those. What? What did he say to me? I'm not gonna play like the one with like Wolf Link and Midna and you know, all that shit. I'm talking about like respectably bad games. Oh. You, lose. you lose. Dude, this game is sick, dude. Can I, Can I click the damn screen? I thought you were wrong, but I... What? I thought you were strong, but I was wrong. What a waste of time. No. I really don't want to continue. Boss. Say another. I want to just test out another character. Wait, did, was it really misspelled? Wait, was continue really misspelled? I did not even pay attention. Holy shit, I did not even notice that. I did not even realize that. No, stop, 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 stop. No, stop, I wanna play the game, now go back. Let me push the start button. What the fuck's the start button on this hell hole? I don't know how to, what the start button is. Oh, there we go. We gotta play as Big Chungus. I thought you were gonna say Live Chungus! <laughs> Alright, quiet. Hey, Wreath, you fight to revive your school? It makes me wanna cry. Big, if you're gonna be a bother, why don't you please leave? Wait a minute, I didn't come to bother you. Anyway, you are so pure. I wonder if I was ever like that. Look at this fucking, this guy simping. This is not, this is no time to rest. Let's get started. Wait, I can't even see the fucking game screen correctly. There we go. <laughs> this fucking blows. <laughs> this game is so bad. What the fuck's the button to hit anything? <laughs> big, big chungus. <laughs> we gotta play it over. I'm actually beating this woman's ass. Dude, Big Chungus is impossible to kill. Holy shit, dude. This is horrible. Is the background music saying Big Chungus? No, it's in your head, dude. I don't hear it.
We won, dude! We did it! Nice. <laughs> big, big chunk, us big chunk. <laughs> is that real Hazuki in the background, dude? He is falling from grace. I like how his fist is like larger than her entire body. We got some Craig items in the chat here. Big Chungus takes no damage. This game was balanced really well. Get Wombo comboed. Yeah, she's doing like combos and shooting arrows. It's like, do 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 And it's like, big, big Chungus, big Chungus. Oh, what was he, what's his victory speech? Don't think anything bad. Women and children should- Holy fucking shit! <laughs> Don't think anything bad. Women and children shouldn't fight. You know how it is. Holy cow. Oh my gosh, where do we find these gems every Sunday? Part of me, even though I, a month of horror was fun, a little bit of me is glad that month of horror is done so we can get back. We can get back to like this bullshit. Yo, Ashley. Dude, this guy is a simp. He's going around hitting on every girl, literally. He hits on them and then when they, when they reject him, he punches them like Ray Rice in the elevator. Oh, Mr. Big, what's wrong? You've come this far. Um, it's nothing. I mean, well, if I had known that you were here, <laughs> why do you have to be so restricted? I'll go easy on you. What the fuck? Does that make any sense? Right. What happened to my camera? There we go. go! She looks like Mitsuru from Persona 3. Sick, the game is sick as shit, dude. Finally, Zach Lawley finally found a game he's good at. Finally, a video game Zach Lawley's good at. I don't know if there's even a tier list for this game. I don't know anybody that would have played this. Yo, win! Yo! Alright, I'm just gonna let myself die so we can see the, the funny continue message. Well, you know what, actually, I believe you guys. I'd rather see I'd rather see what he says when he kills her. I'm sure it's gonna be something insanely sexist and, and offensive as well. So we might as well see that. We have a better chance of getting a laugh out of whatever he says after he beats this woman to death than we are seeing the joke that you guys already saw before. Fucker is the size of the entire screen. <laughs> That's why his name is Big. At least they didn't like lie to the player. There should have been a guy named Little, and he was like one pixel uh, tallness. Isn't that every fighting game? Punch till you win. You don't punch till you lose. Well, I guess you do if you lose the game. But all right, let's see what he says. This music is also pretty bad. Leave it to me. You must return to where you belong, Ashley. The kitchen! What if he said that? <laughs> well, yo, Stin, how are you feeling? What? Oh, Big, I feel great, of course. What is it? Don't eye me like that. You should be looking for him. I see. My expectations were wrong. I won't show you any mercy. You want to fight? Won't find out even if you lose. None of that made any sense. None, none of that made any sense. That's it. That's, that's all I can stomach. I can't handle this. Ready? Go. <laughs> oh, 
Well, uh, it went by fast, but that already that already brings an end to this week's segment of Nintendo DS Madness. Those were all the uh, awful DS games that we had tonight. But don't worry, don't be sad. We will continue with this series in the future. There are tons and tons more Nintendo, uh, awful Nintendo DS games that we have not gotten to that we will play in the future. If you want to see our other parts of this, subscribe to our second YouTube channel. The second link, hold up. Um, subscribe to our second YouTube channel, uh, and we have a playlist called Nintendo DS Madness, and you can check out all the other installments if you want to see a game that we have maybe played. But we will do more in the future, and we also did Nintendo, uh, we did uh, N64 Madness. So, don't worry, there are still tons and tons of awful, shitty Nintendo DS games that we will visit in the future. But that unfortunately brings an end to this week's Nintendo DS Madness. Hopefully you guys liked it.